Hi guys, Omni Nation Comics is here for you. Nice microphone. Omni Nation Comics is here for you. Woo! We got Batman and we got Robin too. Don't forget about Wonder Woman. She will come through for you. Omni Nation Comics is here for you. Woo! Omni Nation Comics is here for you. That's all, folks. Nice mic. Yo, welcome back to Omni Nation Comics. It is your boy Day Day in the house. I'm back. And I gotta say, first of all, before we get started, Mama, oh, Mama, Mama, I know you're gonna see this video. Thank you. Thank you for doing your good singing for the folks. Wasn't she good? Now, y'all know where my musical personality come from. My, my, <laughs> all this is because of her. This is her fault, especially the musical side. My mama got a range, it ain't funny. That ain't the last time y'all gonna see her. Y'all gonna see some more of her real soon. <laughs> but anyway, on to the meat, potatoes, and all that. Put a smile on your face, first of all. Smile, bling. <laughs> Why am I telling you to smile? Because I've heard all y'all requests. I heard, I didn't seen the comments, I didn't seen the text messages, I didn't seen the inbox, all that. Everybody wants to see me do a room tour, and here it is, it's finally here. <laughs> One of the most anticipated book, anticipated books, videos that y'all always wanted to see, and it's about to go down right now. Before I get started though, hit that like and that subscribe button and that notification bell. I'm super excited to bring more content. There's gonna be more omnibus overviews, more omnibus reviews, all that stuff. And a few videos going forward, I'm also gonna be showing you guys <laughs> the fun in this omnibus collecting game. So if you are into that kind of content, hit that subscribe button. It's gonna be fun. Now to the room tour. You about to see everything. It's about to go down. All my omnibuses. The artwork, the video games, my steel books, which I am bringing back to the channel as well. Because I, my movie collectors, I know y'all out there, I'm trying to reach y'all too. Statues, figures, all that stuff, y'all about to see it all right now. <laughs> so let's do it, let's do it. Alright y'all, here it is. This is the room. This is the room that y'all been waiting to see. Got all my Omnis and oversized hardcovers and single issues and all that other good stuff so let's get the party started all right so I'm gonna start over here with some dope artwork I gotta show myself some love and I am a photographer as well also as well a digital artist so my homie Tony Fox cosplay Wolverine for me oh and also got the Wiz Yakuza artwork over here soups versus uh, Batman I like how Batman has the uh, the infinity gauntlet on there <laughs> then of course right here we have the with Yakuza wall of fame here these are his lenticular covers or artwork I should say <laughs> For those that don't know, 3D slash lenticular is basically a, another dimension added to the images. So it makes it feel more real. All you gotta do is move your head left to right and you can see the transitions of, from image to image or position to position. I'll have the links to all these artists in the description below if y'all wanna get some of these prints. It's amazing to have on your wall. I really enjoy this stuff, man. Go ahead, take, take another look at it. I dig it. Then I have some more images hidden in this wall over here. Uh, got Deadpool, Dragon Ball Z. I got uh, almost everything over here. Let me just let y'all take a look. Real cool. 
<laughs> All right, then of course the Avengers in game. This right here, this this poster right here was uh, done by one of my favorite artists of all time. This is Boss Logic. I've been following that man since before he even became famous like right now. I've been following him for a long time. So I'm happy he even made it this far and this big to do a poster for the actual movie. And of course down here, you have some more artwork by yours truly, the Day Day. <laughs> This is my boy Nathan, who was cosplaying Soups. He did a fabulous job. Huh? <laughs> All right, and then we have more Wiz Yakuza art over here. Amazing group of talented artists, Caesar, Christian, a couple of others. Yeah, they're, they are so talented. And they have all the gaming crossovers here. Some fascinating art, man. Sick. Now we're gonna go down here to some more Boss Logic. Got the Justice League Trinity here. I really dig this here. <laughs> That's really nice. Got the whole Trinity. And we got Soups, Henry Cavill. Love what Boss Logic did here, man. Fire. Right, then over here we have my buddy Lou, who was Deadpool for me. I really dig his costume, it really looks like the movie. Really fascinated by it. And then we're gonna come down here. We have another my another homie, my other homie named Nathan, not to confuse him with Superman Nathan. <laughs> but he did a great job as Batman. For me. Gonna move over here to more boss logic. Coolio. Green arrow. And of course, go right up here up top to my artwork right here of my favorite DC character of all time, Mr. Red Hood. Shout out to my homie Eric. Alright, let's go up top here. Here we got the G-Man. It's a bunch of artwork up here. G man, some Dragon Ball Z. Of course, we got more G man stuff. All right. Now we're going to move on to some single issues here. So we got some artwork here from the year of the villain variants. Is it not obvious who my favorite character is yet? Flash, Destro, who is hiding. Looks pretty sickening. And on to more single issues. All right, so this is the Justice League variants for the Zack Snyder Justice League cut movie. I am still celebrating that movie. It is fire. So those covers are fire. I have the third one. I just have to put it up later on. But keep it moving. We have the Berserker stuff over here. Keanu Reeves writing his first comic book. I think it's dope so far. It's a very covers from issue number one. And of course, Spawn, the Chadwick Boseman tribute issue cover. I think that is fire. And then we got the Absolute Carnage variant. With the, it was a tie-in for uh, with Deadpool. I thought that was fire. Then uh, we're on to the Marvel side, so we just showed a little bit of DC. So now we got the Marvel. So here's Thor by Donny Cates. There's Daredevil over there. Uh, I believe that's Brew Baker. Yeah, it is Brew Baker. <laughs> All right, then we're gonna go down here to Cap by Brew Baker. I really, y'all know how I feel about that run, so I think that is fire. And then of course. Punisher by Garth Ennis. That is amazing. Then artwork by Wiz Yakuza. Uh, nope, that ain't by Wiz Yakuza. <laughs> I'm about to mix up the two. <laughs> I'm 
So this is art by Roman, and I have the link to that to his artwork in the description below. So you have the two big bads, Thanos and Dark Side here. By the way, this is the OG. Do not say that <laughs> Thanos. Uh, don't say Dark Side looks like Thanos. No, it's really Thanos look like Dark Side. Get it right. Learn your facts. Then of course down here you have the King in Black variant covers. Issue number one, issue number two. And of course you have some more of some more of my artwork here. We have Spidey. I think that is looking fire. I really dig it. Now let's move on to the Hulk wall, Hulk wall of Fame. So, is it not obvious who my favorite comic book character is of all time yet? <laughs> it's the Incredible Hulk. Funny story about this right here. When they used to celebrate movies back at the 7-Elevens, they all have the little stands. <laughs> and I'll ask the manager. I'll be like, uh, what do you guys do with this artwork here when y'all do it? And they'd be like, she'd be like, uh, no, I'm going to uh, throw it in the trash. And I was like, hey, I'll take it. She was like, fine, you take first dibs. I've had that since 2008. <laughs> and it has lasted me a good while. Then, of course, Hulk by Bruce Jones. I hope we get an omnibus out of all those, man. That's my favorite run on Hulk. I love Peter David, but no, I want Bruce Jones. That was my start when I first read the Hulk. That was my start. The 2008 Hulk movie was based off of this run. Red Hulk here. Yes. And we have my Witcher poster. That is my favorite fantasy character of all time. I love Geralt of Rivia. And next to him, my favorite Disney movie of all time. Now, I love the OG, but the live action. Yeah, I love that too. I love the technology in that one, but the OG is still the best. But there's Simba. Simba! Look, Simba, everything, I'm just kidding. <laughs> everything the light touches. <laughs> anyway, more art by Roman here. Then we have the Injustice panel. They gave these away when the game first came out at GameStop. Really enjoyed it. And of course, you got the TMNT and Bats crossover. Then more artwork by Wiz Yakuza. The Wiz Yakuza team, I should say. <laughs> Mr. Witcher himself, Henry Cavill. And of course, John Mayhew's fantasy artwork. I really enjoy it. Really, really cool. Alright, let's move on to the movies. We got a lot to go through, y'all. All right, so we have the little box sets and stuff over here showing all of the uh, movies from the box sets. But real dope and nice. I really dig it here. I'll do a whole separate video showing each of these individually. I'm just trying to get through it so I can get through the omnis. Then, of course, all of these are DVDs, which I ain't gonna care for because I'm getting rid of them soon. <laughs> Then my, ooh, my DC Universe box set. This is all majority of the animated films before. Yeah, it's like 30 something movies up in there. Yeah, worth every dime. And then, something I'm bringing to the channel soon because I want to reach all of my fellow movie collectors, my steelbook collection here. I'm gonna just let y'all take a look at that. I'll do a whole separate video showing each movie individually. I also have a GameCube up here. I, I found out that still works. <laughs> it still works. All right. Now let's move on to the doggone figures because we have a lot to get through. So let's start over here. I'm going to start over here in the Marvel section. So right here, all of these are from Diamond Gallery, by the way. So I'm just giving y'all a heads up. So we got Thor in game version here. 
burning Godzilla. Really love the details on these guys, man. Really, really nice. And then Thor from the... Actually, this is Ragnarok in the beginning, actually. So that's cool. Really dig it. And then, of course, you have Hulk over here. Awesome. And then Spidey. That's actually from the uh, video game that came out a few years back. I dig it. Oh, uh, Mr. Pool of the Dead. <laughs> Deadpool. All right. Now I'm going to come back over here, y'all. Look at me, y'all. <laughs> All right. Now to the DC section of figures and statues and whatnot. Here's my first premium that I showed. I already did a review and unboxing and stuff like that, so y'all can check that out of Mr. Jason Todd, aka Red Hood, my favorite DC character. Uh, Prime One, Iron Studios, or Sideshow, if y'all can hear me. I need a Hulk statue. I missed the one that I, I could have got last year, but it was so expensive. But man, I want one. I need a good one. Yeah, I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna leave my, that other comments to myself. But I need a Hulk statue. <laughs> I need a good one. Then we're gonna move down here. We got the G-Man. Wait, that's so funny. I go for this big old upgrade and then I come down here. That's okay, ain't nothing wrong. We all start somewhere. Right, okay. <laughs> so we got the G-Man. Mr. Godzilla himself. This is actually the version from uh, Godzilla vs. King Ghidorah. And then, of course, over here, we got Mr. Flash, Ezra Miller version from the DCEU. I like how you got the Parademon down here. That's nice. And then I forgot to show the God of War Collector's Edition statue or figure, I should say, that came with the collection uh, Collector's Edition a few years ago. Was a GameStop exclusive, I think. But anyway, on to the Omnis. This is the part y'all been waiting for. We're gonna do the absolutes and stuff up here. We're gonna start with the DC side. And so, by the way, hold on, I'll scoot y'all back a little bit. I'll give y'all a heads up. This side over here is DC. That side over there, that is Marvel. Come back. <laughs> Just letting y'all know. <laughs> All right, let's get the party started. I have a couple of independent uh, books in here, some images from Image, just because this is the room that I have. So, over here, we have the Spawn Origins the, uh, Deluxe Editions here. These are going for a crazy amount of money. So I'm glad that I got these just in time before they got super expensive, but geez. Uh, and then this here, these are all of my DC Absolutes. So we got Batman Hush over here, Absolute Flashpoint, Absolute Justice League Origin, Superman for Tomorrow, Swamp Thing 1 and 2. That's fire. Wildcats. And then these are some of the DC Black Label books here. Batman Damn, Harleen, Superman Year One. And then these are some of my uh, Rebirth deluxe editions that I got left so far because I sold a lot of my Superman ones because there there's actually two uh, Omnis for Superman I think the uh, new 52 is getting a reprint too so that's cool and then the rebirth is coming out this month then the authority omnibus so we finna start so the authority omnibus all right and right here we got Aquaman by Jeff Johns one of my favorite books that is just awesome. And 100 bullets. And Batgirl. And all the Batman Nightfall trilogy. That looks awesome. Actually, pretty much the majority of this is Batman. <laughs> like my niece Olivia says, Batman, Batman. <laughs> all these are Batman. The Batman by Grant Morrison. Arkham Saga. Batman by Peter J. Tomasi and Patrick. That's cool. So Batman Eternal. Batman by Scott Snyder. One of my favorite runs, man. Batman Rise and Fall. That's the rebirth stuff. Alright. 
Black as night and bright as day. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry for all the ones that be like, wait, that ain't what the spine looks like. Yeah, y'all just got spoiled. It's a little bit of a custom dust jacket. I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you. To, shout out to my homie Kevin. Kevin Sason. He does an amazing job. I'll show those off in later videos. And DC 1 million. We got the Death Stroke. Of course, Flash by Jeff Johns. Volume 1 and 2. Flashpoint that just dropped. That looks fire. The Flash Omnibus. The 52. And Final Crisis. That is a thick sucker. It's probably the thickest one on my shelf. We're going to go down here. We got Green Arrow down here. And the whole Green Lantern by Jeff Johns. Trilogy Omnibus is there. Again, shout out to my homie Kevin. Who does a great job with these dust jackets, man? And of course, Justice League Dark Side War, Harley Quinn, the whole volume one through three, and He Man and the Masters of the Universe Omnibus. This is so underrated. Why isn't nobody talking about it? Hellblazer, aka John Constantine, and Infinite Crisis, and Injustice Volume One and Two. That is awesome. One of my favorites. All right, let's move over here. Over here with the, uh, let's go with JLA. And of course you got the trilogy over here with uh, JSA by Jeff Johns. That is not the last time you're gonna hear that name in my collection. It's one of my favorite writers. And of course, Nightwing, Grayson. <laughs> Again, another dust jacket that doesn't look like the original. But shout out to the homie Kevin. And then uh, Red Hood and the Outlaws. Y'all know that's one of my favorites on the shelf. Swamp Thing. Swamp Thing. New 52 right over there. And then you have Superman, Batman. Superman, the Exile. Superman, the Death. Ooh, the Death and Return of Superman. That book is going for a crazy amount of money. And I left this space open because I had the, uh, the corrupted... Uh, uh, Superman New 52 Omnibus, then they had an error, a printing error. So it's about to be reprinted this month, so I'm super excited. And then we got Super Sons over here. And of course, Teen Titans over there. And then Wonder Woman by Gail Simone. And then we got Wonder Woman, that's the New 52 stuff by Brian Azzarello. And then down here. We have all the image stuff. So we have The Darkness, Volume 1 and 2. Then, of course, y'all know I love Ed Brubaker. So I got Velvet, Kill or Be Killed, and the Criminal Trilogy. Oh, man, I can't wait to jump back into reading those. Now let's move on to the Marvel section. And the Marvel section. <laughs> and to the Marvel section. So... We got Annihilation over here. We got Avengers, the whole Avengers section over here. We got all the Hickmans, Uncanny, New Avengers, and here's the Captain America section. Y'all know I tear them books up. Love me some Captain America. We got a Conan over there by Kirk Busick. Then Carnage. Carnage got his own little section. Then Daredevil. Yes, Brew Baker and Bendis. And Shadowland, that's just, man, I love, it. ooh, it's one, another one of my favorite characters of all time. Down here, Daredevil got his whole Daredevil. Ha! <laughs> Deadpool has his own section, man. So we got it all. We got Joe Kelly, classics, and then Deadpool. Now, well, technically, that Deadpool and Cable is supposed to be called Cable and Deadpool, but I understand they're trying to sell it simply because it's Deadpool, but okay. And then Daniel Way. And we got the Deadpool mini bus over there. That's cool. And Guardians of the Galaxy. And then my entire Hulk section. Got Peter David. I think Volume 3 comes out this month. Or Peter David's Hulk. But that's cool. Hulk Dogs of War. Planet Hulk. World War Hulk. And then we got the Red Hulk. Jeff Lowe. And then over here we got the Infinity section. Heroes Reborn. And then little bit of the Infinity Gauntlet, Infinity War. I can't wait to get another shelf so I can put those Infinities together. Because down here, <laughs> it's 
All right, and then Infinity Crusade, and then both of the Iron Mans from the 90s, Iron Man by Kirk Busiek, then the Mask of Iron Man, and then Marvel Knights, that really should be a Daredevil title in there, but that's okay, I'll fix that later. Moon Knight, and then the Punisher section, all by Garth Ennis, then Spider-Man. Spider-Man got his own section. I'm gonna let y'all take a look at that. So, Spidey. Have it all. Spidey by JMS, Spider-Man Clone Saga, and the Ultimate Spider-Man over there, all the way up to death. Oh well, anybody, <laughs> y'all know, y'all know the story. <laughs> sorry for the ones that got spoiled. I'm sorry. <laughs> all right, now we move on to finish off Spidey's section. <laughs> okay, so here's Miles Morales. And all right, and then here's Thor's little section. So we have Thor by Dan Jurgens, volume one and two, Heroes Return, actually. So, and then Thor by Walter Simonson, classic. Thor by JMS, aka J. Michael Straczynski. Good God, that is a name. Then The Ultimate, and then Venom section, volume one through three, Secret Invasion. And of course, you have. The War of Kings trilogy, and the War of the Realms. Then I have the uh, Venom Oversized Hardcover Volume 2. It's a couple of these books I ain't put in eight sections yet, because I ain't fixed it up yet. But I'll get it together, I promise. Then we're going to go over there to Wolverine. And then we have Wolverine Volume 1. Volume 2 is coming out this year also. And then, of course, Wolverine by Jason Aaron. Uh, Shout out to Omar from Near Mint Condition. We are getting Wolverine and the X-Men to complete that trilogy. So, what? <laughs> I'm so excited to see that. Well, anyway, I'm glad that that's coming. And then Weapon X and then the New Warriors. That has a volume two coming out too. Omar announced that as well. And then X-Men by Chris Claremont and Jim Lee. I'm super excited to have those in my collection. And then X-Men Age of Apocalypse. Then X Men versus Apocalypse the Twelve. Man. All right, and to finish off the Marvel section, Marvel Zombies over there, and Uncanny X Men two and three. I gotta find one and four, and then that'll be complete. And then the old printing of Captain America by Brubaker. Obviously, I had upgraded, so I sold that already. So I'm getting rid of it soon. And and of course, Thunderbolts, that is getting a volume two next year. So that's gonna be fire. And look over here. <laughs> Thank y'all so much. Did y'all enjoy yourself? That is the room. I'm gonna give y'all one more panel. And then uh, I'm gonna close it out. I'm gonna let moms close the video out. But I hope y'all enjoyed the room. And everything thank y'all so much for watching and also my tv got a little cool little light in the background <laughs> i'm such a nerd ain't i ain't i a nerd thank y'all for watching this is your boy day day make sure y'all hit that like and subscribe button and i'll see y'all later peace so guys don't forget to like share and subscribe Mm -hmm. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Woo! Yeah. Bye, guys.